The students in Hilton have a really unique opportunity to take advantage of using school resources to complete a project uh, of their own interest. Oftentimes students don't get a chance to take part in a project and then see it through to completion, but what we're able to do here is to give students the resources that they need in order to structure a project. As far as guidance goes, at the beginning of the project, there's just a lot of help brainstorming and getting going and asking a lot of questions to help gear them towards something that they really do want to invest this work in. Then there's a lot of research help, helping them find sources. There's a lot of trying to help them tap into investing in something that they care about because this is not just a classroom assignment where we're like, here, do this. It has to be something that they care about. I decided to design a logo for the Hilton Dive Team because I felt like our team, as a, like we are four girls and we kind of get lumped in with the swim team all the time, so it'd be fun to have like our own little logo. So I worked over the course of these months to design a logo to put on a t-shirt for us so we can be represented at meets and events. I chose to make a garden in my backyard um, just to you know grow sustainable crops, uh, fruits and such, and as well as to, you know, have some plants to attract butterflies in hopes of having a sustain sustainable food source, as well as sort of preserving nature in the area. So the project represents the culmination of the middle years program of IB. So in Hilton, that program runs between grades five and 10. And so after years of using the learner profile and the approaches to learning, the students are able to apply those um, aspects of the program into a project of their own creation. We feel strongly that this project is something that will benefit students when they are going to college interviews. They're able to talk a little bit about something that they are very knowledgeable about. It also gives them a great sense of pride in taking part in building a project from the ground up and then seeing it through to completion. The biggest part of why this project is, is really important to the district is it not only teaches them a lot of different facets of education and, and group project and, and organization, but it also gives you the opportunity to see other people's positions and see everybody's project and see what other people are involved in and what they care about or what's important to them and gets to really focus on you know these students that do some great things in the community and being able to see all these different projects and all these different uh, abilities that these kids have and, and passion that they have about certain things is really important and uh, I can't think of anything better that this district does than uh, allowing these students to uh, partake in this process. For people doing this project in the future, it's a lot of dedication. Um, it, it's definitely a lot of work, but it's worth it in the end. It looks daunting at first, it looks like it's a huge product, but once you get into it, just use, honestly, it's use time management. As someone who ne didn't necessarily always do that in the past, it's really helped me in taking out a lot of stress from what I've heard from a lot of people who've done it. I learned to reach out to people as well, uh, talk to people if you have questions. You know, my father's done construction stuff as well in the past, so I asked him some questions about that, how to put it together. Don't procrastinate it, you know, get to work right away because you're just going to be stressed and have to cram everything in and it won't be fun. <laughs> the personal project is really fun to get involved in if you, if you pick the right thing to do. We encourage parents to get involved as much as they want in the project and to be able to support their students at home uh, for, for creating a project. Uh, additionally, we always are willing to have students look for mentors in the community so that this becomes bigger than just school.